So when did you start doing this? Um, I started writing a long time ago. I think I seriously started writing in SS when I was in Achimota. But um, seriously, seriously writing, I started um, during my national service. I stopped writing for a while after National SS. service? What is that? Um, after university, every, every um, Ghanaian has to do national service. Okay, because I don't think many people outside Ghana oh, know that. Oh, okay. So. Everybody has to do national service. So after. what did you study at university? I did rural art. I uh, majored in textiles and metal work. Metal work? Yes. <laughs> so a kind of engineer? Um, something like that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. Do you have uh, an example of your work? Something you know by heart that you can... Um, you yeah, can, uh, I know a few. Yeah, I know a few. Can you give us an example? Um, okay, I want to give something really short since I'm now... The yeah, interview okay. is now starting. It's more of a romantic piece. I wrote this recently. Um, so, I didn't mean to love you. My plan was to stand at a safe distance so I wouldn't notice your pupils towering mine. The intensity they held was a swirling ocean and standing at its shore was risky business since I never did learn how to swim properly. I wanted to be far away from your skin so I wouldn't have to hear its lips speak my name. Lord knows I always gave when the darkness whispers and your chocolate layering against mine looked way too complimentary. I didn't want to fall in love because new age defines it as an emotion with too many rules I don't know how to follow. I don't know how to swallow the hoarseness your voice flaunts in the morning and not hunger for more. I don't know how to fall and pretend like I wasn't lonely before. 3 a.m. conversations don't hold back the tears you've been meaning to shed since the last heartbreak. My skeletons trust trusting words and yearn for new playmates. You shouldn't have come close enough to touch my senses. I touched you back, forgetting in the moment, I don't know how to let go. Yeah. That's beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. And you did, yeah. Spoken word, yeah, you do it very well. You capture the emotion of the, of the piece very nicely. Thank you. Yeah. So, uh, what is your ambition with your art? What do you want to achieve outside? having the pleasure of creating it and sharing it with a, a select or a small group of people. Is there something else you, you would like to, to achieve? I would like, I would like to share with a, a bigger, on, on a bigger platform to a larger audience. But like I mentioned, I would prefer to, I would prefer an audience that actually appreciate my work. I don't want people to come out just because it's a spoken word show and spoken word is new and it's fun. And so they just want to see. I want people to come out because they know me and they actually enjoy what I do. They can relate to whatever it is that I'm saying, whatever it is that I'm speaking about. I want people to be able to sit down and think, why is she writing about me? I think that's, that's one of the greatest satisfaction I get from writing.